My name is Marisela Oma, uh, currently an intellectual property consultant. I formerly worked as the executive director of the Kenya Copyright Board. In the recent years, we've had a lot of developments in the ICT sector in both Rwanda and Kenya. My case study looks at indigenous community entrepreneurs. Specifically, I'll be looking at how the information, communication technologies and any emerging technologies can be used by these particular communities in relation to traditional cultural expressions, specifically those that are used in handicrafts, how they can actually use the different uh, technologies to, to improve their business and what they need to do to be able to scale up and get their, their products out into the market, both locally and internationally. And one of the, the core issues is the importance of uh, open collaboration in innovation. One of the, the most important things is what is known as the traditional knowledge commons because it creates an opportunity for the knowledge uh, within the indigenous communities to be shared. So you find that uh, one community would be able to have information, for instance, in relation to weaving or uh, basketry or the, you know, the different handicrafts that they're dealing with. So, so there's need to be able to have this information in a place which can be accessed by other communities to the extent that it's going to be used uh, in such a way that it does not prejudice the interests of the originating community or the community that actually holds that particular knowledge.